Chad GPT said. In the Orion constellation, the night often flickers with the glow of Betelgeuse, a massive red supergiant that has captured human wonder for centuries in every sky. Its vibrant hue and epic size make it one of the most mysterious objects seen in the cosmos from Earth's viewpoint. You can spot this gigantic star with just your eyes, shining steadily from a starry landscape filled with myth and science. Located in one of the most iconic constellation patterns, its behavior continues to astound astronomers who watch its cosmic dance unfold. This stellar giant is not just known for its beauty, it's also unstable, showing flickers and fades that puzzle observatories all over the planet. Recently, Betelgeuse lit up the night sky by increasing its brightness by 50%, becoming the seventh brightest star visible to observers in the scene. The sudden luminosity spike confused experts who weren't expecting such a dramatic change from this distant starfield. This glow triggered debates in observatories about whether this was a warning sign of a coming supernova or just a random anomaly during its twilight phase. If a supernova happened, it could turn night into day over parts of Earth, lighting up the sky like a celestial spotlight and giving scientists a rare real-time glimpse into a star's final moments. These brightness swings only increase the growing interest in its looming fate and mysterious countdown. The light a star gives off depends on many elements like size, distance, and temperature, and Betelgeuse stands out on every scale in the night scene. With a radius more than 700 times larger than our sun, this stellar monster maintains surface temperatures between 3000 and 3500 Kelvin, painting it red in the stellar canvas. This unique mix of size and color is what makes Betelgeuse such a strong candidate for a spectacular supernova sometime soon in cosmic terms. That's why its current signs of weakening are drawing attention from astronomers all across the world stage. In late 2019, this red giant suddenly dimmed until it glowed at just 40% of its usual brilliance a rare moment seen clearly even with naked eyes from clear skies. That visible drop set off waves of discussion in science centers about whether it was dust, internal changes, or something bigger. Some researchers blamed dust clouds that may have blocked its glowing light, while others guessed it was deep internal shifts from within the stellar core. At the VLT Observatory in Chile, the star was studied in great detail with high-tech tools capturing this scene. The resulting images showed Betelgeuse had gone lopsided, hinting that it might have pushed a large part of its outer surface into space like a kind of celestial eruption. This event is known as a surface mass ejection, or SME, a scene similar to cosmic volcanoes. During that ejection, Betelgeuse reportedly hurled about 400 billion tons of matter into the space around it, far more than what a solar flare would normally release. It raises a haunting question. How long can such a colossal star keep burning before collapsing in a supernova burst? When a massive star like this runs out of fuel, its core collapses under gravity, sparking a brilliant end to its long stellar drama. If Betelgeuse goes supernova, the first clue we would get is a rush of neutrinos, small particles that escape a collapsing core even before any light shines across the cosmic scene. These particles would reach Earth hours before the light, serving as an alert for the explosion. When the actual explosion light follows, Betelgeuse could shine brighter than the full moon, possibly casting shadows in the night like a full daylight scene. This surreal event would last weeks, giving skywatchers and scientists a rare stage for observation. To better understand Betelgeuse, scientists now use simulations powered by real data from JWST and VLT, combining visuals and metrics to model the final phases of this star's journey. These simulations reveal that a gas bubble rose within the star, sparking the mass ejection and disrupting its heartbeat rhythm. Images from JWST show swirling gas and dust around Betelgeuse, adding evidence that it's nearing its final phases. Although predictions suggest a supernova could happen in the next 10,000 to 100,000 years, its recent erratic behavior points to something closer. In late 2023, JWST recorded a fast internal collapse within Betelgeuse's core, disturbing the nuclear fusion reactions and altering how the star breathes over time. Before this, its surface pulsed in a steady 400-day cycle, much like a cosmic rhythm. Now that rhythm is just 200 days, showing the star's internal landscape is changing rapidly, a kind of dying heartbeat across the galactic view. The fusion processes are shifting from lighter to heavier elements like iron 
which signals the point of no return. Unlike other reactions, iron fusion doesn't release energy, meaning the star builds mass until it collapses catastrophically. That's why this stage is so critical, and why experts are divided about how soon the collapse will happen. Some believe the end could come in just a few centuries, while others feel the star has more time left in its act on the galactic stage. But everyone agrees that the neutrino surge will be the key signal that the final scene is near. Scientists across observatories now monitor Betelgeuse constantly, waiting for this signal and preparing to capture data during this extraordinary event. Thankfully, the explosion poses no danger to Earth, but it will be visually astonishing, a glowing eye in the sky's nighttime drama. This spectacular moment would not only thrill viewers, but also help experts learn about stellar death, a process that influences galaxy formation and the creation of elements critical for life. Each detail we gather helps tell the story of how we all came to be. Through advanced tech like JWST and high-resolution ground telescopes like VLT, we now study the stars like never before, bringing the past, present, and future of the cosmos into clear view. These technologies make it possible to simulate stars, analyze pulses, and even peer back billions of years into the origin of things. Famous scientists like Neil deGrasse Tyson say such discoveries bring urgency and thrill, as we inch closer to understanding life's ultimate questions through stars like Betelgeuse. When you next look toward Orion's belt, know that one of those glimmers may soon stage the greatest light show in history. Are we seeing Betelgeuse's final act, or is it just part of its long cosmic cycle under the galactic spotlight? What do you believe? Drop your thoughts in the comments and help unravel one of the universe's biggest mysteries. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.